Hi, good to have you on this channel. This is Parlin Science and Mass TV. To my returning viewers, I say a very big thank you. Now, if you are new on this channel, you are warmly welcome. On this channel, I talk about things that are related to science and maths. So I solve problems related to mathematics and science in general. And so if this happens to be what you are interested in, I'll be glad if you subscribe to this channel. Now in this video, we are to simplify 3 minus root 5 or divided by 1 minus root 5 or this squared. And so, why don't you pause the video and try your hands on this, after which you can compare your solution to that of mine. And so what I'm going to do is that I'm going to focus on what is inside the bracket. Then later on, I'll apply the square. So I'm just going to simplify what we have in the bracket and later on, I'll just apply the square someone too can also decide to apply the square to the numerator and the denominator and then simplify so let me just go with the first approach you can try the second approach so what i'm going to do i'm going to simplify what we have in the bracket and this will give so we have we have three minus root 5 all on 1 minus root 5 so what i'm going to do is i'm just going to multiply the numerator and the denominator by the conjugate of the denominator which is 1 plus root 5 all on 1 plus root 5 so remember that all this squared so that we'll just have 3 multiplying 1 plus root 5 then negative root 5 multiplying 1 plus root 5 then all these divided by 1 will multiply 1 plus root 5 and then negative root 5 will multiply 1 plus root 5 and we have all this squared and so we'll end up with 3 plus 3 root 5 minus root 5 minus 5 all this divided by we are going to have 1 plus root 5 minus root 5 then we have minus 5 all this squared so we are going to end up with 3 now we have 3 root 5 minus root 5 remember the coefficient here is 1 so we are going to get 3 minus 1 or root 5 so that will give us plus 2 root 5 and then we have minus 5 all this divided by we have 1 minus 5 because these two will cancel out so we have all this squared so we're just going to have now we have 3 minus 5 at the numerator so that will give us 2 root 5 minus 2 this divided by negative 4 so we have all this squared we have all this squared so simplifying further we are going to get we are going to get 2 root 5 divided by negative 4 then minus 2 also divided by negative 4 all this squared so we'll end up with 
negative 1 on 2 root 5 minus no positive 1 on 2 all this squared so what we are going to get is that we are just going to square both sides we are just going to square both sides so upon expanding we are going to get i'm just i'm going to expand using the principle a plus b all squared the principle says that this is a squared plus b squared plus 2ab so in this case our a is negative half root 5 and our b is 1 on 2 so simplifying this will give us negative half root 5 all squared plus half all squared plus 2 times negative half root 5 times 1 on 2 so the square affects the negative 1 on 2 and we'll get 1 on 4 times 5 plus 1 on 4 then we are going to get plus we are going to get minus now these two will cancel that so we'll be left with negative root 5 times 2 which will give us negative root 5 on 2 negative root 5 on 2 so this will give us 5 on 4 so 5 on 4 plus 1 on 4 will give us 6 on 4 6 on 4 so 6 on 4 minus root 5 on 2 and this will give us this will give us 3 on 2 this will give us 3 on 2 because 3 goes into this 2 goes into this 3 and 2 goes into this 2 so 3 on 2 minus root 5 on 2 and this will give us 3 minus root 5 all on 2 therefore the simplified form of 3 minus root 5 all divided by 1 minus root 5 all square is 3 minus root 5 all on 2 thank you for watching this video let me know any other approach you have to this and please if you haven't subscribed please do subscribe to this channel bye bye